Well, hopefully, hopefully everybody can hear me. I know there's a lot of stuff going on, but uh, welcome to the senior night for Norris Cross Country. Um, and we've got a quite, you know, a good, nice collection of seniors here, and some of them have only been running for a season. Um, and, I, and I think it's been, usually what I tell the kids is that not every day is going to be fun, but every day should be rewarding. And I, th I think that's really what cross country is all about. The day after a workout or a hard meet, we, we, we throw everything out there, we feel accomplished. We feel like we've done something to better ourselves. And all... <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> you, can't, you can't have a Norris event without Mr. Ring. Oh my god. How long? He can go. This man has like the biggest long time. Honestly, it's probably recording. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Most of the runners that are seniors this year didn't start as modified. I think Andrew McCarriello was the only one that started as a modified runner. Uh, and, he, and even with only with all the latecomers, they they all kept on coming back um, and year after year. I think what's most impressive about cross country is that if you start doing the numbers, if you start adding up the number of miles that they've run every single day summer training that they were supposed to be doing, races that they've done, you know, beats of their hearts, gallons of sweat, it's a lot, it's a lot. And it's just really impressive what these runners have done uh, for the team. They really th thrown, put themselves out there for their team in, in many, many times before. And I'm really proud of them and happy for what they've done for, for me as a coach and for their teammates as well. Um, they've done a great job. They all have a flower that is supposed to go to their parents for being so supportive. And if they, I know they're teenagers, but if they haven't thanked the parents, they really do need to thank their parents for being supportive because it's really important that you're all here, you're supporting them, you're helping them at this time in their lives because they're all very young and they're, they're going to be going doing great things, great things next year and the rest of their lives. And I hope that they do those great things, obviously, um, and I hope that cross country has helped them get to where they want to be. All right, so Hannah debates. Go get the flower. And then we'll get the parents behind them. So Hannah, go get your parents. And actually, let's have the parents come. <laughs> we'll get organized here. Okay? And then Reagan Clark, Grace Bookemer, Nick Deedy, Julie Rogue, and Andrew Vaccarello. The parents can just stand behind. So we'll, we'll take a photo. <laughs> Flowers go to your parents. I'll stand all over the place. That'd be so cool. Grace! Alright, bye. You got it. <laughs> <laughs> I love all the big cats. I mean, my mask is Not really. Hannah, show your head. <laughs> I just did not cry. Thank you, everybody. Thank you all. Enjoy your time.